Hello everyone. In this video, I will show you how to display your Google Sheets datasets with date and time fields in a calendar view. I am using Calendar Package for this. I will post the link in the description box. In this spreadsheet, you can see that I have different sheets for events, tasks, and sales. In the Events sheet, I have fields for date, start time, and duration. In the Tasks tab, I have tasks and their due dates, and in the Sales tab, I have sales amount and sales dates. Let me show you how the different datasets look in the calendar view. In the Settings tab, we need to configure a few things. First, select the sheet. After selecting the sheet, all the following drop-down fields will be updated automatically with the headers from the selected sheet. The fields in yellow, like id, title, and date, are mandatory. Let's configure the settings for the Events tab. Then, hit the Save button. Now, go to the Qualendar menu and click on the button named Show Calendar View. Here you can see the events in a nice calendar view. You can even toggle between different views like Day View, Week View, and Month View. Let's try with the tasks data. Here is the tasks data. We will change the configuration in the settings tab accordingly. You can also set the color of the card here. Then hit save configuration. Now open the calendar view. If you want to share this calendar view without having to share the sheet, you can do that too. You can deploy the script to get the web app URL. Here, you can see I have opened the web app version of this calendar view. Let me show you the last one quickly. It's working fine. Now, how do you set this up for yourself? First of all, make a copy of the spreadsheet from the link given in the description box. Then, open the custom menu named Calendars and click on Show Calendar View. When you click it for the first time, it will ask you for authorization. Go ahead and grant all the required permissions. Then, then go to Usins tab and save configuration. Click on the menu item again. And it's working fine. You can add new tabs with your datasets and then set new configurations in the Settings tab based on the newly added tab. One more important point to note is the date and time format. You must choose the formats as I have in the sheet. Now to get the shareable link, click on Extensions and then select App Script. Then, click on the Deploy button and choose New Deployment. Select the deployment type as Web App, enter a description. In the Execute as dropdown, select me. In the Who has access dropdown, you can choose only myself. If you want to share the link publicly, then choose anyone. Finally, click on Deploy.
open the web app URL in the next tab. And here you can see everything is working as expected. If you found this useful, then please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.